All right, so uh, we went ahead and uh, I, I traveled all the way back across the mansion and back. Oh, yeah, that's right. So I got the uh, the poison, the, the chemical to use on plants. And I, I picked up my, uh, I ditched my knife and I picked up the, uh, the kerosene uh, because there's going to be, I'll show you what happens here. This is a pretty great setup. You hear that noise and then you see a silhouette there. It's so, so well done. And you put two and two together and you realize, oh no, I know it's just about to happen. Super creepy though. <laughs> now here, yeah, here's where things get a little bit interesting too, because you're like, oh, what's this uh, water pump uh, doing here? And you're like, oh, what is that? <laughs> and of course, as you get closer, yep, it comes to life. So the virus affects more than just... It affects just about everything, it looks like, because now it's affecting the plants. <laughs> Such a good reveal. Uh, no, we don't want to pump the water yet until I add the chemical. This will, of course, kill the plants. What you want to do here is you want to switch it to red because there's herbs on the green side. You don't want to kill the herbs, so you but you want to kill the plant. Die. <laughs> we'll just keep it on there. And oh. We've got a healthy supply of herbs and what's this? It looks like one of the death masks. So that's our first death mask of the game, but I do want to mix up some herbs here real quick. Take as many as I can with me. And that, invent that limited inventory space is really hurting me right now. We'll mix up an, a three, we'll mix up three green herbs. That, cause that creates a super uh, herb that'll basically heal anything. And I'll take the mask with me, because that's our main goal here. And as you'll soon see, once we step outside here... Oh, where did they go? Oh! <laughs> this place is... Uh, was truly out to get us in the in the remake. Uh, let's see. Oh, I forgot about you. Um, uh, there's no room. I'm gonna have to waste of. I picked up a flash grenade, and this is pretty cool. You shove it in their mouth. <laughs> and one shot does them in. Of course, it works better when there's a, a bunch of zombies surrounding them. That way it takes out a bunch, but uh, I had to waste it. And I didn't have a dagger either, that kind of sucked. There will be more opportunities though. Okay, so we got our first death mask. I'll stash this herb here. Uh, I can't get the shotgun yet. I, in fact, I, I better go pick up the broken shotgun right now. Because it is just in this room on the right. And of course we will use this to switch places with the actual shotgun. Uh, yeah, I, that's right, I filled it up. So... So here we go. We're going to go get ourselves a shotgun, ladies and gentlemen. That ought to even the odds a little bit. Uh, which way should I go? I'm trying to decide. Should I go through the second floor? I guess if I just go through the first floor uh, there, it should 
be relatively clear of enemies. Although, as I go through there, of course, things will take a turn. <laughs> uh, let's just go ahead and go through the first floor. Because it's relatively safe. There are a few obstacles, and now these guys roam the corridors. Uh, oh, 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 <laughs> A lot of close calls. Oh, that's right. I was wondering where our buddy was. I killed him, uh, coming back here. <laughs> So, no longer any zombies in that room. We will get to this grandfather clock later. We will just cut through the bottom floor here. I don't think anything happens in this hallway. That guy's still wandering around back there. Yeah, I didn't think anything would happen. It's it's later that s stuff starts to happen. Now there is this guy wandering the halls in here. Oh, that's right, that comes through the windows here, too. Uh, okay, I'm gonna try. No, no, it didn't work. Oh, yeah, okay. Things are getting bad. Real bad. <laughs> this place is starting to get a little crowded for my taste. Time to even the odds. Oh no! I don't have any space! <laughs> I didn't even think about that. Alright, I'm gonna have to spin some bullets, I think. That way I can clear up a space. Hope this goes well. I don't think I'll be surrounded. If I'm surrounded, I'm screwed. Shit! Uh, get off of me! See, if I had that grenade right now, this would be a much more ideal situation. Oh my god. Shit. If I could get him to fall on top of the other guy, I could burn them both at once. I am really risking it here. Oh no, he's still alive, and I don't have my knife. God dang it. <laughs> Oh, man, I really stepped in it there. This might be bad news bears, ladies and gentlemen. Walter Matthau. But I am able to pick up the shotgun now, so I think I'll be okay. Yeah. And we'll place that there. Thus, defeating your trap. Oh, yeah. This thing is great. So there's a little reward the game gives you to kind of make you feel <laughs> like you're sort of in control still. Although, one bite and I think I'm dead. But, we'll find out if I die. Oh, jeez. Oh, man, that was close. Okay. Man, should I stick around? Oh, man. Come on, come on. I'm waiting for him to lunge forward. I'm gonna have to waste another shotgun shell. Oh! Okay, still alive, still alive. You'd think a shotgun blast would have done it. Shit. Uh, 
Oh man, that could have gone. Oh, there's another one. Okay, he's dead too. Oh, weird. Set the other guy on fire. Damn, I thought I would get all three of them. Try not to stand in the flames, too, because they will burn you. Oh, no! No, don't die! <laughs> oh, my God, I'm still alive. Dang, it didn't get... Oh, that's right, I blew his head off, so he's dead, dead. Okay, they're all dead. Anything I can pick up. Oh, he's just chilling right there. I didn't even see him. God, that scared the hell out of me. Oh, jeez, there's two. Oh, man. Damn it, I really don't want to waste this last shell. I could fill up the kerosene out here, and there's herbs. Oh shit, that's right, the dogs. <laughs> I'm really stepping in it right now. Damn it. Oh, I want that red herb. I don't think I can mix it right in the menu, though. I have to have both of them in my inventory. Alright, that was my last shell. I'm totally defenseless. Oh, uh, no! Oh. I'm, oh man, I'm so so out of breath right now. I'm gonna have to use it just to survive. Oh man, <laughs> I'm taking way too many risks. <laughs> well, at least oh no, you're still alive, aren't you? I do not need you running around still. Okay. All right. Well, we're sort of, sort of screwed here. My knife, I think my knife is still in this. Is there a zombie here? I forget. Spencer family emblem, okay. Oh, jeez, yeah. Shit, 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 shit. Uh, can I get around you? Yes. What's in here? I forget. Oh, the portrait gallery. That's right. Well, if I could get through. This will lead me to the graveyard. So then I can get rid of uh, this death mask. Okay, what you gotta do is line up the colors with the items. Lisa, protected by the three spirits. So, she's wearing a bracelet, a necklace, and a crown. The crown is green, the necklace is blue, or purple, and the bracelet is orange. So we gotta match the colors. So we gotta turn this bracelet orange. And then this necklace purple. So that's good. These crows don't really do anything unless you get the puzzle wrong and then they attack you. Pure white, well. Oh, I think I screwed it up already. The uh, crown was orange, right? No, it's green. God dang it, I screwed it up. So this one has to be... Orange. Okay, that's right. Orange, purple, and then this last one will be green. Uh... Uh... There we go. 
That ought to do it. Yes, I will press the switch. Da 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 da! And there's our next death mask. I can't pick it up yet though, so we'll just unlock this gate. Kinda wish there was ammo too. I thought there might be, but I guess not. Oh, really? Oh, I thought I could just unlock it from the other side. <laughs> I need a small key. <laughs> oh, boy. Okay. Well. Oh, man. That means I've got to go all the way around again. Oh, no. This guy's still here. But, okay. At least we can get past him. Luckily, these guys are dead. And, uh... Oh, yeah, when I came back here, I left some bullets in the room on the right. I'll go ahead and look over a way out. Wesker. <laughs> That's right, that... that Wesker... It, so, it lets you know that, hey, you're not the only Stars member around. Which we already knew, because, you know, we met Rebecca and Richard, but... You're still... There's a, still a team effort, even though you're doing a lot of the work. <laughs> Uh, okay. Should I take the... I think I should ditch the kerosene for now. I burned up a lot of zombies. Guess I could use this first aid spray real quick just to heal up. Now I'm not on the verge of death. Ah, oh, damn. I wish I could get rid of this freaking key. Uh, no. Okay. Warm light makes you relax. Ah. Okay, so we're gonna have to play this by ear. I believe this guy's still alive. Or there's a there's a zombie in here for the most part. You know what? I should de ditch these death masks for the moment. Oh man, this is where the real survival here is going to slow things down a bit. I think as long as I ditch the items near the point where I'm going to use them, I think I'll be okay. That's how I'm going to play it anyways. Let's uh, cross our fingers and hope I find some bullets. Damn, still not useless. Because I used up the sword key and I ditched that. Oh, that's right. This is where the soundtrack really shines too, this creepy little... It's a large scratch on this wall. It doesn't look like it's from one of those rotting freaks. Oh, we're gonna need a small key. Jill would just be breezing right through here. Look at these camera angles, man. That's so cool. Oh, da 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 da. Oh, and there's an ink ribbon. Look at that candle, so cool. Uh, I guess I'll take it with. I'm gonna need that ink ribbon. Well, no bullets. <laughs> Okay, that's disappointing. I got shells, but they're with Rebecca at the moment. Go ahead and use up this old key. 
Um, mm, I don't feel good about that. I probably should have just went down to the graveyard. Okay, we got another super herb. I'll grab these ink ribbons too, then we'll head back down, store some of this shit, then come back up. Someone left in a hurry, okay. So creepy, I love this music. <laughs> I think it's just in that room, too. I'm sure it pops up somewhere else, but mainly it's associated with that room. Lots of backtracking in this game. Okay, let's ditch the ink ribbons. That way I have a, at least a healthy supply of ink ribbons. I'm going to try to keep the saves to a minimum, even though I'm not really aiming for that. Just my way of handling things. What the f What? Is this door gonna open? What door was that? Huh. That was real odd. Oh, jeez. Jeez. Did he wander into that room? Is that what happened just now? Oh, man. I barely dodged his ass. I didn't even know he was there. <laughs> Researchers will. Oh, that's right. This poor guy. There's, there's a letter. June 3rd, 1998. My dearest Alma... Let me first apologize for not being able to call you. A man wearing sunglasses didn't permit any phone calls. Sorry, Alma. Hmm. A man wearing sunglasses. Okay. I sit here trying to think of where to begin, or, or how to explain to, in a few simple words all that's happened in my life since we last spoke. And already I fail. I hope this letter finds you well, and that you'll forgive the tangents of my pen. This isn't easy for me. Even as I write, I can feel the simplest of concepts slipping away, lost to feelings of despair and confusion. But I have to tell you what's in my heart before I can rest. Alma, please believe that what I'm telling you is the truth. Oh no. <laughs> the entire story would take hours for me to tell you, and time is short. So accept these things as fact. Last month there was an accident in the lab, and the virus we were studying leaked. All my colleagues who were infected are dead or dying, and the nature of the disease is such that those still living have lost their senses. This virus robs its victims of their humanity, forcing them in their sickness to seek out and destroy life. Even as I write these words, I can hear them, pressing against my door like mindless, hungry animals. Alma, I have tried to survive only to see you again, but my efforts only delayed the inevitable. I am infected. There's no cure for what will follow, except to end my life before I lose the only thing that separates me from you. My love for you. In an hour, I'll have entered my eternal sleep where there is peace. Please understand. Please know that I'm sorry. Martin Crackhorn. Well, this guy ended his life. That's right, this puzzle has... Uh, something to do with lures and fish hooks. So it's blatantly obvious from the diaries we've been reading that there was an outbreak. Oh yeah, there's there's a nice little troll associated with this uh, puzzle. Uh, do I put the golden one back? I can't remember. Don't press the switch just yet. Oh, okay. So it's the other way around. 
I have to take the B and put him here. Yeah, th that makes sense. Putting the lore where the lores should be. And then putting the insect where the insects should be. This is pretty funny. Oh, one of the crests. Watch what happens, though. <laughs> You're like, what? <laughs> Giant bees! <laughs> And it's flying around. Screw this room. <laughs> uh, okay, now this guy can just chill. Oh, look. He's, like, staring at the... The bighorn. <laughs> okay, buddy. You, uh, do, you do you. Oh, jeez. He didn't like that. Did not like that at all. Uh, okay. So now we got one of the crests. We will also stash this here because I believe... That it's gonna be used... It's use is coming up. So I'm gonna go ahead and save it now. Not exactly in the best position ammo-wise, so I'm gonna create a separate save file. But, uh, wow. Cup. I got surprised there. That's uh, pretty rare. So uh, I'll uh, check you guys in the next.